Hello again, YouTube, and welcome back to another Dumpster Dive Nights. So, it is snowing again in western New York, so congratulations, it is cold again. But it's not snow covered to the point where they're not putting garbage in the dumpster, so we can actually give you an episode. So, as you can see, the dumpster looks pretty full. There is a huge display there that's partially metal, or at least a very shiny gloss plastic with some hinges, so I'm really excited about that. I wanna see what that is, because that looks pretty awesome. So we're gonna get into the dumpster and clean off that, and we'll get back to you after I'm in the dumpster. I would like to state the obvious. At least it's not raining and hailing this time. No, it's just like, you know. Jesus. 18. Okay, come up here. I need the light. I need the light. Look at all that snow. Holy. Is that a computer? <laughs> oh, that might be one of the demo game systems. Dude, <laughs> I'm taking it with me. No, how the heck are you going to fit it in a little car? Oh, oh, God. oh God, I'm going to go get the truck. I don't fucking care. Okay. First, what is this? Dark Star. Somebody throwing paint out in the dumpster. More light. What the hell is this? Holy shit. It looks like someone threw out something else over here. Look at this. Is that the monitor? That's the monitor. I guess it's broken. Yeah, the amount of shit they've thrown out that isn't broken, I'd really like to, like, actually prove. Shine right here. This is all components to a Wii display. And right there actually might be the Wii. So. Oh, fuck. It's so cold. Okay, so here's the box. Uh, hard plastic display case. Wii U sign. The Wii sign. The light hookup. This is a part of the component. I actually want to try to salvage this because if we can salvage this and actually hook it up after I dry it all out and get it back together this could be worth a lot of money and by a lot of money i've seen these things go for anywhere from a quarter of a million dollars up to five million dollars holy crap so it's actually no joke but gamestop isn't allowed to keep this stuff they either give it back to the company or the company tells them that they have to throw it out the monitor is still there and i don't think it's cracked yeah i don't think it's cracked What's this? A white face plate. Another back plate. Yep, our wires go. Oh, yeah, there's a CD. They even give you the startup disc. And oh. the one behind it, too. Come on. On the other. Oh my god, yep. Demo disc. They give you the demo disc. That's worth money just in itself. And there's another one. You have to talk to And the Steve. paperwork. <laughs> uh, another case. I'll keep that. That's demo GPK demo cat one November 15th. So that's for the November 15th stuff. So.
Yes, my hands are very cold, guys. But this is going to be a pretty awesome episode. So I'm pretty excited about it, nonetheless. We're going to take out all these frames. We're going to put them down on the ground safely. It is just plastic. The snow isn't going to hurt it as long as I keep the stickers and stuff away from it. Like and as long as I don't break any of this. So here's a part of it. Here's a part of the promotional part of it. Nothing smoking, guys. It's just my breath because it's that cold. Okay. This. By the way, it is so cold right now and my hands are wet from the snow that my hands are freezing to the metal when I touch it. Just letting you know how cold it is. The only thing is, is the trick of getting that home. Um, or even a little... Oh. Now, it is partially damaged, but that's just a cord. So if I undo this plate here, I can get a replacement cord for this. It won't be 100% from the factory, but all the components on the inside and stuff will still be good. Um, or if we can just salvage the Wii U inside of it, that's pretty exciting too. Uh, let's see. Oh. Everything's frozen. To the There's bottom. the frame holding, that's the bracket that holds up the TV to this. Cord. Here's the power cord. Not damaged. So we do have the power cord. The DC cord. As you can see there. Okay, monitor next. I think my fingers are freezing to your phone. Holy shit. Oh god, it's cold. Oh fuck, that's cold. Um the monitor is a Lynx, a Lynx monitor. get most of the snow off of it so it doesn't start melting. Because here in New York, you can experience all four seasons in one week. Okay. Put this very, very carefully on the TV screen. Do not drop it on it. Now, for a moment of truth, we snipped those two. That is completely fine as well. That goes here, push that, then holds. Ah, okay. That they removed. Of course they removed that. That is fine. Guys, the system is not in here, but we still do have a display that could still be worth a ton of money. No, it's as tall as me. Shine it, shine it in here. Posters. All ripped up. Obvious.
would have loved the Horizon Zero Dawn promotional advertisement. You fucking assholes. So to give you an idea of what they do is this sits the other way up. What they do is they have these cords plugged into the back of the wall. In the front side, they have that panel, but bracketed to it is this framework and the TV screen. All this is hooked up with the wires and the power cords. All of that's put together with a Wii U and it's just the display case. Now this right here um, without the system is still worth a bunch of money if everything works, if you replace the cords that were snipped. Replacing the cords that were snipped is not that bad, and also you can still find the exact same cords on eBay or Amazon that went to this model. Um, it's very easy to get the cords and the components. The only thing that's not easy is getting the actual framework because you'd actually have to get that from the company. That's why GameStop has it, because they get it from the company because they are a wholesaler of the company, which is Nintendo. Um, some background information on this. Uh, the most expensive unit that was ever sold was an Atari unit that ended up selling for about $35 million. Uh, that unit now is appraised for about $1 billion and is being kept by a collector. So as you can see over the years, these things can be a lot of money. Um, I'm hoping to get into contact with my friends tonight and see how much he can actually get this sold for uh, at the condition that I am going to send the photos to him. Obviously it was in the snow, so it's gonna be very, very tricky to sell it. And I have to make sure that everything works. So I'm gonna get it home and we will have to end the episode here. I'll let you guys know on Twitter and my social medias how this is going. I'm also going to have to buy a brand new Wii U system to sell this as a full display model. But that's not going to be too hard either. So thank you guys for watching this episode. And as always, leave a comment down below in the comment section. Any questions or concerns, uh, subscribe to the channel for future content like this and any other content on the channel. And as always, stay violent and be privileged. We'll see you all in the next dumpster.